All right. Hi, guys. On my last video, I told you that I sh you should stay tuned and wait for something new and exciting from Culture Tech Knives. So, here we go. Culture Tech Urs. Culture Tech is the Russian knife making company, and Urs in Chechen's Chechen language means a knife. So it's hard for me to say Urs the knife because you know basically you'd be saying knife the knife. Um, so guys, I had this knife for a couple of days now. And this is what I want to tell you about this knife. If you don't have one, <laughs> go get one. Or maybe even two. Uh, such a beautiful and interesting design, you know. Materials, all that milling work. Uh, fit and finish is incredible. You know, when I received the package uh, from Russia, you're going to see this. A uh, nice, beautiful wooden box. On the inside, on the inside of the box, there was a knife right here. Uh, there's a special pivot tool. That uh, way, you can you can only unscrew and screw this knife if you if you plan it to clean it up. Only with this particular tool. What else on the inside? Under this nice padded, um, there's. Uh, Cleaning cloth, certificate, certificate that it says in Russian, uh, we thank you for your choice and uh, and trust. And there is a certificate of authenticity, URSS, the number, uh, blade, M390, materials, and everything else when this knife was made. So really, really high quality things high quality certificate in the box itself so i'll put this box on the side and we'll get back to this uh to the knife um so the flip tab on this knife when you when you when when you open the box and right away you notice and there where's the flip tab flip tab is so it's not even noticeable you know you can barely see it some people some people call this front front flipper. Some, I, you know, honestly, I don't even know what to call this. Uh, but entire knife, like check the back spacer, for example. It's not even the back spacer; it's the titanium corkscrew. Yes, yeah, it's titanium corkscrew, and uh, it's really needed tool for like almost every man. And I know some people are going to say. Wait, uh, why do I need the corkscrew inside of my knife? And guys, here's my answer. Why not? <laughs> exactly. Why not? You know, um, just because I can. So, and when you open the blade, guys, when you open the blades, you just, you know, honestly, you just want to stare at this beauty. It's cloudy mirror, I would say, or, I don't know, this M390 blade after Dennis Frolov. AKA, uh, AKA Yan Hu Kin treatment process turns this blade into something like unreal. That, like I said, mirror, cloud mirror finish, unlocking mechanism, unusual locking mechanism. I honestly like never seen anything like this before, guys. You know, I saw liner locks, I saw frame locks, uh, I saw axis locks, but this one, this one is. I see it for the first time. Uh, Culture Tech called this joint lock. Uh, there is a little story behind uh, behind this locking mechanism. When Culture Tech already made this knife, one of the Spider uh, representatives contacted them and said, "You know, guys, we already actually have uh, this locking mechanism, and it's already patented. So the modification is." Very different from what Spyderco has, but it still falls under the the patent law. So, what Culture Tech did, they bought a license uh, to, to manufacture hundred knives uh, with this exact lock. 
uh, from the Spyderka company. Um, guys, there was a couple days ago, Culture Tech on their Instagram and the Facebook pic put the picture of, of this knife, of this knife's, how it looks on the inside. And um, very complicated work, very complicated work. And this is probably more parts in this knife than AK-47 machine gun. Um, I'll post the picture right now side by side that you can take a look at these images. Um, but back to knife and the knife specs. Um, so blade, blade length on this knife is 100 millimeters or uh, it's 3.9 inches long. Overall length 230 millimeters or 9 inches. Weight, yes, it's it's not really ooh, some. I'm not used to this one. Um, you know, my my finger goes to the frame lock all the time, but you know, I think I'm gonna get used to soon. Uh, weight on this one is 150 grams, so it's not really light knife, but you know what? Feels really nice in your hand. Feels really sturdy. Um, so I think. I think that's it. That's it about this knife, about Urs from Russian knife company, Caltra Tech Knives. Um, guys, thank you for watching.